Hey folks, I'm Serene Glory, and welcome to part 24 of my playthrough of Scotland in Europa Universalis 4. So, we managed to survive our wars just about. Obviously we had to release all of these Irish nations uh, and the Isles in order to get peace with the East Frisia coalition. So that hurt us quite a bit. Uh, we also lost Flanders to Ghent. Uh, because of the rebel problem down there that we couldn't resolve. However, on the positive side, uh, we managed to hold off Denmark and eventually got 1,100-odd ducats from them for peace, uh, which went towards paying off all our loans and building a few churches. Uh, so, it's not all doom and gloom. We're making a lot of cash right now, uh, so we're building up the army again. We need to increase our military power so that we can then vassalize these nations and work towards reintegrating them. Um, we have another merchant, so we've got somebody in the North Sea already. Uh, so I guess, actually, I don't have any real power down here and don't have any anymore. What about my places in here? Hmm, okay. Uh, never mind that. So we will... Where's the best to put somebody? You're already steering trade towards the channel. So are you. No, you're steering trade up there. I'll transfer trade power from there. And it all does flow eventually into the English Channel, or most of it. I think we might transfer trade power from Krakow. Robert Ferguson, out you go. See how we got in with that. And fine. Um, I don't want you transferring it down there, I want you to transfer it here. Let's see what difference that makes. Oh, quite a bit 1.5. Yeah, so hopefully. That'll help us up here. Now that we've got our troops raised, let's get us uh, yeah, some more of these guys. Corruption's increased. So let's reboot it out. Army maintenance will bring you down a bit further. Okay. So, vassalization minus 21. Economic base needs to be improved again for those guys to agree. But if we can get vassalization in here 
And that'll help the economic be they'll actually accept it already. Um You would be the one that went for it first. Tax modifier of 50% or two base tax in Lothian. We'll go for the national tax modifier. And we'll get another couple of men in there, a couple of units. Yeah, so Ireland. Let's improve relations again in here. We're still a ways away from the alliance, but I can't afford... So who have I got an alliance with? England, Isles, Tyrone. Oh no, I can't. I need 190. No, I've got... Yeah, I need 190 uh, opinion. So you can go there and do that. We've maxed out our mill power again. Let's strengthen the government. I do it a couple of times. That's a bit better. Uh, now, it's only 31, Queen's 29, who's 50 prestige. <laughs> Morale of armies and navies, etc, etc, is all useless. Improved relations though, I need to wait. Aggressive expansion, do we still have any? Hmm. Wait a bit longer. No chances from the Isles. For what reason? You're at war with Sligo. Um, yeah, okay, you can go and knock each other out. And Sweden didn't get their independence. Depends for Burgundy. Yeah, we've taken you once, we can take you again. Right. Sixty-two, damn it. We need sixty-five, hundred and sixty-five. Sent you a gift. Privilege plays Yeah, so that would improve by six, uh, 25. It still leaves them three short. Hmm. Okay. we go. So if we send them a gift, that should tip them over the edge. Send a gift, 25. We can live with that. Netherlands get a claim, yeah, whatever. Get that vassalization offer in there. Minus two. Improve relations a wee bit more. Civil War in Burgundy. Don't need to pay any attention to that any longer. Now. Lose one stability and get all that, or lose one stability and get 10 people influence. There we go. Uh, we didn't get any 
real relations improvement in here. Hundred twenty. Hundred twenty. Hundred twenty. Let's send them a gift. Twenty-five. Go with that. And still not. Still get minus two. Hang on. What is going on here? Queen Consort died or something, okay. Let's boost that back up there. Okay, I uh, forget that. You still at minus two. Let's offer them military access. We'll come back to that. Economic base is a problem. Fifteen loyalty would be good. That would take them up uh, to above sixty. But we need their influence to be higher for that to increase the trade efficiency. National tax modifier. There's nothing really we can do here. No, uh, that, that was a clicked by mistake. What does that give us? Does it give us people influence? No, it's send emissaries to the Pope. That's what I was thinking about. Anyway, we have uh, an Inquisitor. Fantastic. Uh, the reason I went in there was to see if there's anything I could do to improve our economic position. Unfortunately not. Oh, what? Oh, Artois. Do what you like in Artois. Let's sort of corruption again. Designate as a march. No. And the Isles, you're nowhere near, probably. Minus 17, you're, we are improving. Because we're a bit stronger than we were. Can I get a royal marriage with anybody? Awfully, yeah, that's right, they had offered us one before. I... Uh, Let's go back. We've changed our mind. Okay. Need to get rid of this guy. Well, probably can't get rid of that guy. Because we don't have a source of another ear. Let's improve relations with Sligo.
Yeah, let's definitely improve relations. I think I might just go for the limit on uh, relations. Because there's a lot of these guys we could get back quite quickly. I'm going to build all the relations up as much as we can. How about Ormond? We're already improving in there. And I don't want uh, England. Damn it. You're already under England. Um, too late for that then. Yeah, so let's see what we can do. You're already a vassal. Um, minus 21. Minus 4, getting close. And their money is still pumping up. We've got another couple of them. That one's got another culver in as well. Okay, so our low countries are all reverting back to their pre well, not all the previous owners, but most of them. Who's this now? Brabant. No, Flanders. You've taken over Brabant. Okay, how close? Minus one. Tell you what, let's yeah, pull you back from Thoman for now. Get you in there to build up relations just a wee bit further. One. Truth with Denmark has ended, but I think I've got enough manpower there to deter them from attacking. They only attack me when I'm weak. Uh, 35 admin power for 10 loyalty. Yeah, I don't want to lose legitimacy. Admin power is probably the lesser loss. Uh, minus one, yeah, just check that. It's desperate for it to happen. Minus 19. Minus 17. Okay. Uh, you're pretty much maxed out. Let's pull you back. Off of the alliance. Yeah, too many relationships, but never mind. Minus 21. Let's get a royal marriage as well. Minus 11. So hopefully we'll get that up soon. Let's uh, improve relations again. Income Bonanza. 25 trade power. Lovely. We've maxed out with the Isles and we're still not there. Again, still the economic base is a problem. I 
I need you to have some influence. <laughs> and lose the prestige. And give us a wee bit of trade efficiency. Lose prestige and legitimacy. Or I could go with this guy and get 15 influence, which is actually better. Do that and I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Yeah, I'll lose the ducats, get their loyalty up. And then here. That guy, oh, he's only 25% cheaper, he's too expensive. Get another general. Okay. I clicked the bank. There we go. He's 19. Uh, you'd already a vassal. Where? Yeah, Annex Vassal, well, that's what I was looking for. It's 1569, so it's not too far away. Uh, that's awfully... On one, minus 11 still. You're still at minus one, damn it. Okay, what about man? You would actually accept vassalize, although this is way down. And it's plus 27 improved relations as well. It's an alliance and a royal marriage. Let's... Let's improve relations, see how high we can get them. And we might be able to squeeze the vassalization out of you too. There's my fleet. Come here, fleet. Let's put some cash on two more ships. At least I'm not reliant on Denmark for the war reps. This is all my own cash. Um, okay, Cardinal Minister gain 10 prestige. Grudge State gains 5 influence. That would still be okay. People influence plus 0.5. We'll go with that. Desmond and Normand we've maxed out. So, uh, Desmond is Cork. You can get the alliance there. And where else was Ormond? Uh, 16 still. We've got the alliance, we've got the royal marriage. Military power again is an issue. Hmm. 
me it's 19 we'll leave that for now come on aisles I feel like going back about a hundred years in time, trying to get Ireland under our control. I actually, had it. Protestant zealots where? Yeah, in the continent. That's okay. My ship's nearly ready. August. And there. Yep. Trade efficiency or mercantilism. I think we're going to go with mercantilism. No! How did we manage a new king without a stability drop? Of course, he's 15 already, my goodness, and fancy that. Um, let's put our focus back on Mill. Can't really afford to bring in an advisor right now. It's still at minus one, so it's not affected that. Minus 17. Okay. Hang on in there. Right, we've got our ships. That's down here. 36,000 troops. You go and do what you like to do. Um, yeah, so our other ships are out protecting trade again. So things are slightly better there. Probably not enough to make a difference here. So I guess I need to just keep saving up, get buildings all over the place. I'm going to put the army maintenance back down to zero. Whoa, Denmark! Commonwealth and Muscovy. Ooh. <laughs> um, same religion. Enemy of enemy. Not looking forward to having Muscovy as a northern neighbour. But anything that weakens Denmark, I suppose, is good for me. Okay, and again we've maxed out on mill points. Our government needs stabilised again, or strengthened. So let's spend 200 mill points. And why not boost stability as well. How much does it cost? 135? Yeah, do it again. Still no difference. Ormond. Let's try Ormond. Still minus 19. 
Yeah, that's our truce of that coalition up. There were a lot of them, as you can see. And there's no coalition against us anymore, for some reason. that affect things not there necessarily oh you will accept vassalization now no it's not that's still in tyrone nah ormond minus 19 why can we not are they at war no nope. We are at peace. We do have an alliance. Our opinion. And just because it's green doesn't mean their opinion's 190. And there isn't anything else that we can do there to improve things. We can get an alliance in here. We don't have, you don't get a minus to your income from having too many diplo relations. Okay. You can stay as you are. Oh, that will take the prestige. I'm just thinking that is it better to get this alliance and the vassalage? Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, as soon as we can send somebody, it's still at minus 18. Okay, Royal Marriage, Goonham, uh, Queen Consort's not bad, it's minus 8, uh, improve relations. Let's get us some buildings, uh, where can we get? Church and West March. I'll get a good enough positive economic situation if it kills me. But for now, I'm going to put in a break. So, we've got far too many relations. Hopefully we will integrate. I think we can start that in three years or so. Uh, let's... Oh, they've already got military access. No, it doesn't make a difference. That, that just affects their opinion. Anyway, as I said, I'm, I'm going to put in a break. Um, pick this up again next time out. So for now, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please leave me a comment, rate the video, and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content. And I hope to see you again next time. Cheers.